Is that a band or something? Here's you have to give away level 100 magic carps. <clears throat> if I had any, yeah, sure. <laughs> what I want to do is I want to breed like a team of level 100 magic carps and uh, battle test Lana with them. I want to do like a six on six all magic carps battle. I'm going to mess him up with some of my uh, with my choice banded tackle magic carp. You guys, you guys will not be able to handle it. Oh shit! Is this thing a physical or special set, or is it mixed? You gonna flamethrower me? I gotta check. He's just gonna freaking DD on me if I King Shield, but we'll see. Oh yeah, oh yeah, Fletchling. Mm. I mean, it's hard to say. Well, hopefully, I can take an attack. Happens to be Earthquake. Well then, it's an anime. I haven't seen it, but, uh, I guess what's it about? <laughs> I'm always, I'm always down to watch new anime. Yeah, you, you better watch out this Lana, man. Like, my banded carps. Like, I'm gonna have one that's, like, scarfed, and you're gonna be like, what? What? Resonance, you're so meta. Like, how, how do you come up with these ideas? And, and don't even get me started, this on my focus sashed magic carp that's gonna have flail. Check yourself before you wreck yourself. <laughs> Fate Stay Night's great. Hmm. Hey, please, please live this earthquake. I beseech you. You failed me, you're dead to me, Age of Slash. I'm done. I'm done with you. You're dead to me. Oh, this thing's got moxie. Please be banded or something. Alright, well this will kill it, but uh, that was unfortunate. I was really hoping I would live that. Historical figure is anime flight? Badass. Uh, one Piece, No Two, and Fairy Tales Return. Oh, this better kill this Glaceon, please. Please. Oh, you failed me. Oh, m never mind, Garchomp. I love you. I love you. You never failed me. Yeah, I might do uh, some giveaways in like the middle of the live stream just to reward people, I guess, who've been sticking around. Uh, do I risk the confusion hacks? I'm just gonna switch into Gumshoe and pray that it's not a two-hit KO from whatever Mega Horn or whatever the hell this thing does. Oh, the big bad Caterpies! Uh oh. Please don't be a two-hit KO. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Wait, what the hell? That thing's life orb and that wasn't a crit and that actually completely killed Gumshoe. Interesting. I don't recall this thing being that much of a bamf, but... Isn't it like... What's this attack? Oh, 135! Holy shit. Alright, I guess that explains it. I thought this thing was shittier. Huh. This Pokemon doesn't actually seem that bad. It just looks stupid. Interesting. Actually, it doesn't even look that stupid. Hmm. I'm liking that thing more and more. Maybe I'll get into Scavule. Interesting. Interesting. Hello, Richard Dortiz, 98. My science this looks fucking weird. <laughs> oh no, it's Jolteon, no! Stop with the special attackers that happen to be carrying Shadow Ball. Please, enough, enough. No more of this. Shadow Ball's probably a 2 KO. I'm not gonna risk it. Hello, Andre. I am doing the Battle Maison right now. Uh, and the Battle Maison sets all Pokemon to level 50. Uh, just like all competitive battles do, and the Battle Maison is basically competitive battling against the AI in exchange for awesome, sick item rewards. 
Okay, so he just went for a T-Bolt. Fake Tears? Oh my goodness, okay. Anyway, yeah, the Battle Mason is just you playing against the AI for sick battle, uh, for sick rewards, and the AI, I mean, the Battle Mason is really hard. It's like the hardest challenge the game will offer. Hyper Beam, Fake Tears? What the hell kind of Jolteon set is this? That shouldn't do that much to me, though. Oh, look at Gumshoe. He's taking these hits like a badass. Oh my god. He's using a Drill Run plus Life Orb. Oh. I see. Thanks, Tonka. Um, I'm not sure. But yeah, I'm just trying to get some Battle Mace on points. This Luxray is going to be trouble. The last Luxray I saw in the Battle Mace on happened to be some sort of weird charge uh, set. I'm just going to go straight into Garchomp. Fuck my dick off! Really? Really? Oh my god, this thing has Ice Fang. Ugh. Alright. I guess in retrospect, uh, I didn't... I've never seen Luxury. I did. Oh fuck, this thing is Air Balloon. I'm retarded. I should've just put it without Rage. Did not th know that thing can learn Ice Fang. No one uses that. Alright, well now that I know it's a physical attacking set and it's not some weird ass charged thunder brain dance set that I saw earlier today, I'll just go for a King Shield here and watch him gimp his own attack stat. Wow! Okay, this, so this thing's got all the elemental fangs, is that it? Why would you run Thunder Fang on Luxray and not Wild Charge? That's what I want to know. So, you're telling me this Luxray has Ice Fang and not Crunch? Or Fire Fang? What the hell kind of moveset is this? <laughs> I'm confused. I'm so confused. What, what What is he running? Ice Fang, Thunder Fang, and... I don't know what charge? And, like, Quick Attack, I guess? I don't know. Okay, well, hopefully, whatever his last guy is, Age of Slash can sweep it like nobody's business, but, uh... What kind of cheesy Care Bears bullshit is this crap? <laughs> the Battle Mason always keeps me on my toes, man, because the AI is either running, like, really standard sets, so... Oh, he's got T-Wave! Okay, alright. Okay. Okay. We'll be fine as long as. Oh god, the last uh, Luxury that I fought, like, it T-Wade me, right? And Aegislash swaps forms before the para hacks can happen, so. If I go for a Shadow Sneak here and I happen to get fully paralyzed, I'll be in my offensive form and just fucking die. So I really. Okay, thank god. Good, good job, Aegislash. You did it. You did it. Ah. Good stuff. Gengar! Just what the doctor ordered. How would you like a Shadow Sneak? Fuck. God. Alright. There goes my win streak. Oh! Oh, Aegis Slash, why? Why you do this to me? No! Oh, come on, Gudra. You can do it. Come on, Gumshoe! Oh my God! Don't get poisoned. Ah, uh, you know that would have been a that would have been a three KO if you didn't get poisoned. But you got poisoned, so. Oh my God! Gumshoe pulls through in the end. Oh, th how can one Gudra be so based? That experiment was a failure, sir. Gumshoe always comes through in the end with that crit. Oh, so good. Gumshoe, new NVP. Ah, oh, that felt good, man. <laughs> the clutch plays. He always pulls through when you need him, man. Haha, -ha, I can see it clearly. You were a doctor from an evil planet, aren't you? What the fuck, Pokemon? 
I don't even. I straight up don't even. Oh god, it's this creepy thing. <laughs> if you have the 3D on, you can see Mr. Mime's like hands up against the screen. It's actually terrifying. I don't I don't even know what set this thing's running, but maybe it'll let me set up. Please let me Oh no. Oh no, he's got Shadow Ball. Oh no, he's got Shadow Ball. Okay, this is... I will live this, and then I get another Swords Dance up, and I get a special defense drop, which is tragic. Oh my god, somebody kill this thing. Get it off my screen, this thing is hideous. I'm done. I'm done. Alright, Mr. Mime, are you ready for your prostate exam? I'm going in. First blood. Oh, of course that thing. <laughs> yeah, no, it's definitely. Oh, okay. Okay, this thing has like all kinds of priority. I think it has sucker punch, or it could, and it definitely has shadow sneak, which is bad. All of its moves are physical. If he wants to kill me now with priority, I can block it with a king's shield and lower his attack stat or he might straight up go for a will-o-wisp this better not be that horrible horrible stolly dust noir set with no offensive moves and like rest pain split will-o-wisp uh and sleep talk it better not be this set i swear to god if it's this set i'm going to have an aneurysm i'm gonna go for a king's shield predicting a shadow sneak please 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 Shadow Sneak? Shadow Sneak, if it's a will o -Wisp, please. No will o -Wisp. Yes! Alright, this isn't that stupid stall he does nowhere said. I feel a little better now. That he does, Pokemon Master Ren. That he does. Can I live a Shadow Sneak after that? I think I'm just dead. No matter what I do, I think this thing will just will o -Wisp me or something, right? There's no point in going for a double king shield. And I do not think I can live a Shadow Sneak. Dusnoir is okay attack. So I think I'll just go straight for Shadow Sneak. Not gonna be super greedy. I would like to set up more like Swords Dances, but it's risk. Oh my goodness, I actually killed the Dusnoir. This thing is bulky as balls. I did not expect it to live. I mean, I expected it to live. Hello, Cameo! No, you're right, Tonka. I just want one more Swords Dance, but that's not gonna happen. I yeah. Well, I, I the thing is, is though, is I don't know what set that uh, Dustnor is running. Is I have a minus speed nature and zero speed IVs. Uh, so it's a risk, definitely. What is Dustnor's speed? Is it like thirty or something? Cause like Age Slash is only like what fifty. Or is it like 60? I don't know. It's really bad. Uh, so that does not work. If it, for some reason, okay, it's 45. Yeah, and if he's running, I don't know. It's the Battle Mason, man. I don't trust him. Okay, I'm 60 speed. It's certainly possible that I guess I, I was concerned I might be slower anyway, just because I have no speed investment at all. You never know. You never know. Hello, Goo Chasm. Dust Noir. Defeated. Bring it on! Give me my next victim. It's it's pretty bulky. I mean the low HP might seem, you know, like a big detriment, and I guess it is in a sense, but this thing can really another scientist? Okay. I think it really take hits though, with a max HP and a max of one of the defenses. I wasn't even plus six, so I expected him to maybe live, but uh, maybe I am underestimating Aegis Lash and overestimating Dust Noir. Oh, these things are always special. 
I'm gonna go for King Shield just in case. He's probably gonna. Er oh. Okay, he went for Protect. I was gonna say he's probably gonna Earth Power me or like Flamethrower or something. Okay, balls. I don't actually know what this thing's gonna do, so I'm just gonna go straight into Gurchomp. Yeah, the battle may on, man. That's where anything is possible. <laughs> you never know. You never know. Okay, so this is actually a physical Nidoking. King. I actually saw like a physical, uh, like Sheer Force Nido King with no moves that actually use Sheer Force. It was actually great. Well, let's see how well you handle my earthquake, sir. Not very. Oh yeah, no, Dusk Dusclops with Eviolite is definitely bulkier. But Dusknoir looks so cool. Uh, I don't know what his plan was with this Magnezone, but uh, unless it's sashed, it's not... Oh, my... No, wait, it's got sturdy. Right. Oh, my. Rip. I'm just gonna kill you with a Shadow Sneak. Hello, Tonto. Yeah, no, this is this Pokemon Night. Uh, Aoe Night is Friday. Hello, you are. How's it going? Yeah, the Battle Mason is pretty darn weird. Oh God, what Venusaur set will we find today? Well, if it's Sleep Powder, I've got the plan. I switch into Gumshoe. Gumshoe is immune to Sleep Powder. He has Sepsifer. Do you? Oh my god, this guy has a substitute Venusaur set. Oh, okay. Well now, okay, well I can just I can just break the sub with a flamethrower. <clears throat> Not a big deal, but who runs sub on Venusaur, man? You crazy kids. It's probably one of those sub seed sets. Uh, so I guess, yeah, that exists. I'm just more used to some sort of uh, Mega Venus or I guess. Wow, this thing is going to take decades to kill, and that did nothing to me. Thank you, Base Assault Best. Sorry, Veggie Chops. Sub Seed, eh? Does this thing even have Leech Seed? Oh no, they're totally smoking crack here, man. That's what they do. This guy's gonna keep subbing, right? Or, all right, eat flamethrower. Ah, oh, oh my God, this—he <laughs> really went for another substitute in a row. Like he was like, "All right, Gudra is gonna break my sub. I gotta sub again." What if I switched out? He would have just failed. Man, yeah, the battle my son is full of surprises. All right, what's his plan now? He's gonna get baked. Gumshoe is dominating. Wow, Mr. Scientist, thanks for that. <laughs> yeah, man, if that was Mega Venusaur, I would have pissed myself. Like, legitimately. This is why I run Sap Sipper, just because. Just because of that stuff. Gooey is good too, but Sap Sipper really comes in handy because people don't really see it coming usually. I think after like one or two rounds of this, I'll be done uh, with the Battle Mace on. But I just wanted to do this for a little bit. Show off how weird Acid Trip the Battle Mace on actually is. My goodness. Aerodactyl, eh? Oh no, I'm too nervous to eat berries. Well, I think I'm just gonna go for a Swords Dance. Please be a three hit KO. Oh my god, Age Slash, you suck. I don't really have anything that can one-shot this. I really don't think an Outrage will kill it. Maybe an Outrage will kill it? You never know, because this could be one of those weird max HP, max defense Aerodactyls. Thank you, Battle Maison. Actually, an Outrage should kill from 100%. I was hoping that he would go for something else, something stupid like a Substitute. <laughs> Actually, I think it'd be pretty cool, honestly, if the Battle Mason did a Mega Pokemon in it. That'd be kind of nice, rather than uh, those pseudo-legendaries. 
Alright, eat outrage, son. Man, Aerodactyl's strong. You strong. Please, for the love of God, don't have a focus ash. Okay, good. The Battle Maison is the kind of place where, like, you'll see an Aerodactyl, right? And it'll be, like, spamming Earthquake. And then I'm gonna hit it with an Outrage, right? And it turns out, like, 9 out of 10 times that they have some sort of berry that conveniently always resists whatever move I'm using. So, of course, of course the Aerodactyl would have whatever berry, you know, allows it to resist Dragon-type moves. Of course. In the Battle Maison, that's what they do. Thank God that thing didn't have that, or, like, some sort of, uh, Focus Sash. Okay, Shuckle. There's one thing I've learned, guys, is you do not fuckle with Shuckle. So what's my plan on killing this guy? I'm gonna switch into Gumshoe. Why? Because Garchomp's confused and I don't trust him. It's the Battle Mace on. And I'd go straight into Aegislash, but I have no idea what this Shuckle's gonna do. Sandstorm. This is the kind of time where I wish I had a Taunt user. Oh god, Shuckle! Eat! Flamethrower- oh wait, I should've just Dragon Pulse, actually. Why did it jack sh- Oh my- I knew I would get the burn. I knew it. The predictions... Wait, that is a- Rap Sandstorm? I'm gonna be Shuckle. Yeah, I'm gonna be doing viewer battles after probably this battle against Shuckle, because this could take a while. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, alright, I'm gonna bet you guys five bucks, I swear, I swear this guy has rest on his shuckle. Wait, I can't switch out, right, because I'm wrapped? That's what I thought. Oh my. Well, at least I burned him. Please don't have rest. Oh god. Oh god, Charlene. Please, Mr. Shuckle, have mercy. Shuckle, please. Dude, that's not bull, man. That's all skill. I bet this thing... Does this thing not have toxic? Like, why is he spamming rap? You gotta, man... You gotta get that rap sandstorm toxic damage over time. I fucking... I shouldn't have opened my mouth. Of course he is toxic. I bet the, I bet the last move is rest. I bet. I swear it's rest. Shuckle. Please, no. Stop. I've almost killed him. I've almost killed him. Now all that needs to happen is that he does not rest. Please don't rest. Don't rest. Or crit. Crit. Come on, Gumshoe. You always pull through. Arrgh! Wait, this thing... Wait, this thing doesn't have rest? Or is he going to rest now? Wait, up, but I'm faster. I think I win. I think Gumshoe wins. I did it! I did it! Oh my god, alright. So I did fuckle with Shuckle, guys, and it actually worked out. Who are you? <laughs> Yay! Alright, that, that turned out extremely well. So that's the Battle Mace on for you. And of course, if any of you are watching this on YouTube and you want to see me do more Battle Mace on or other Pokemon shenanigans, man, I uh, I do live stream regularly, so love to see you all there. Are we gonna interrupt? It was a uh, that was a fun fun match. That was a fun series of Battle Mace on stuff. Always enjoy it. I'm gonna just save my game, and I'm gonna get ready for some viewer battles, guys, and we'll get right into that very very shortly. So. Stay tuned.